Frontrunner Donald Trump again promising he will win the nomination in Cleveland this summer. But as the seven investigators have learned, a Michigan man, one of Senator Ted Cruz's top supporters, is one of the masterminds behind an elaborate push to stop Trump. Seven investigator Jonathan Carlson with the story. On a quiet residential street in Lansing, you'll find one of the biggest threats to Donald Trump's candidacy. I think in order to win, you got to stop Trump, right? He's Saul Anuzis, former chair of the Michigan Republican Party and one of Senator Ted Cruz's top advisors. I think he's a better candidate. It's this man's job to help Cruz wrestle away Trump's presumed nomination, and it'll likely happen in Cleveland at the RNC convention this summer. I think we got a very good shot at being the nominee walking into the convention. You see, neither candidate is likely to arrive in Cleveland with the necessary delegate threshold to ensure the nomination, setting up a floor fight that could surprise the nation. And laying the groundwork is what Anousis is doing right now. Call it a Stop Trump movement. Crew supporters, from our perspective, are recruiting other crew supporters to run as delegates to the local conventions. The local conventions then elect the delegates to the district conventions, and the district conventions elect the ones to the state convention, and at the state convention, we pick our national delegates. Despite earlier voting, many delegates will enter the arena as independent and can swing their vote once the convention is underway. We've organized a 50-state effort. Uh, we, are, we have party leaders, conservative leaders in all 50 states that are recruiting delegates. You have to win a majority of the delegates at the national convention, period. The strategy bets on a Trump revolt and true conservatives falling in line in Cleveland. I'm not sure that that's true. Meaning Trump has beaten the odds before. Political analyst Tim Kiska. So when push comes to shove, are these Cruz delegates going to stick with Ted Cruz or are they going to bolt over to Donald Trump? Nothing's been a given. I mean, everything has been a surprise. It's Saul's job to eliminate the surprise and derail the front runner with old fashioned political science. When you look at who the delegates are, most of the delegates who come to the convention are people who've been involved in the party for a very long time. And they're more likely to go the traditional route, he says. But who knows? This campaign has been anything but traditional. In Lansing, Jonathan Carlson, 7 Action News. Oh.